What's good, South Jersey? I'm Isaiah Showell, and I'm at the Bridgeton Riverfront for the annual Cinco de Mayo Parade, highlighting local businesses in the area of Bridgeton. So I should start with the new kids on the block. Angeles and Blossoms Flower Shop, located on Commerce Street, and Miss Amy and Crystal Dorado say the community has embraced them fully. I think flowers bring a smile to everybody. I feel like um, you never have a moment where you're giving somebody a flower and they're not smiling. So I feel like um, entering this business has just been very positive. I feel like there's never been a negative moment in, in starting a business and even transitioning the business. We've only had a lot of love, so we just want to thank everybody for the love we've been getting. Christian Tapia of Christian Photography Services took some pictures of me on the spot while telling me about his new business located on 44th North Laurel Street. Everyone in Bridgeton should come on down to give him a try. We do sessions, uh, maternity sessions, baby sessions, like any sessions that, that, you can, that you can come up with, we can do it. So I can get my headshot with you? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. we do corporate uh, on site and in the studio. What's your prices looking like, man? Well, we, it varies. It depends. It goes from $100 up to thousands of dollars, depending on, on what you need. Because we do we do videos, too. We do uh, photography for weddings and all the stuff, and videos for photography, I mean, videos for, for weddings and all the stuff. Christy Manzo of Kai's Crystals was selling bracelets and crystals to raise money for her pet, Kai, who began having seizures in September. And now she's doing what she can to help save her beloved pet. It was just so traumatic, but um, I have to get a, a MRI for him, and it costs like three thousand dollars for like the whole procedure and everything, just to find out whether he has something going on or not that's more serious. Um, so again, like this is just kind of like a little side thing that I'm doing to help raise that money um, and kind of awareness as well. Miss Patricia Gonzalez of the cosmetologist business Maria Machetes came out representing cosmetologists in South Jersey and states that people's reactions from her work is so rewarding. After it's all like done, I, I love when they're like, I love it and they look beautiful. The transformation, I love that. Which is why I chose to do cosmetology now because it just goes hand in hand. And because they're always asking, like, do you do hair, or nails, or you know, all the other stuff? So yeah, it just it just goes hand in hand in hand. And I already have my clientele built up, so it only made sense. And it's something that I've dabbled into since like high school, and I never got the chance to go. Or I just kept like pushing it back. And now I'm like, no, I have to do something. And it, it only made sense, you know, to go to cosmetology because I already do the, the makeup. So yeah, it'll go hand in hand. Miss Neary Almost of the business News From My Land, located at 13 Northeast Boulevard in Vineland, New Jersey, has such a nostalgic feel in her store, but it's all on purpose. We try to incorporate a little bit of every country. That way, you know, like people who have come over here and left everything from over there, like can get a little bit of reminder of, you know, like the warm feeling, like when they come in here to see something from what they left behind. But you know, this event would be nothing without the people who showed up and participated in celebrating the day. And the people say they enjoyed themselves. It's good food, nice people, entertainment. Bring your kids, have fun. Amen. It's really, really nice. Uh, all the movement and the music is really awesome. There's music and horses and, and it has a lot of food. Rosalinda Garcia, president of the Bridgeton Main Street, Stephanie Gonzalez, UEZ coordinator for the city of Bridgeton, and Cameron Hudson, representing the Hope Loft, collabed to make this day possible. And they're very happy with all the results. I just want to thank everyone that came out here, Rosalinda and Hope Loft and UIZEA and all the UAZ vendors that came out today and supported us. It's really important to be able to come together as a community with the local nonprofits that are already doing great things in the city. I also want to give a shout out to the police department, fire and emergency um, department for the city of Bridgeton. They came out today to support us as well. So I look forward to more events. We're having an event June 15, so I welcome everyone out there um, with the Chamber of Commerce. In Bridgeton, I'm Isaiah Showell with Follow South Jersey, and that's what's good in South Jersey this week.